Representative Brian Mast announced new legislation he hopes will stop Lake Okeechobee water releases. He made the announcement to address the toxic algae crisis plaguing Treasure Coast waterways. Our Tori Sinkovic is in Stewart with his new plan. This bill will revise the prioritization system for the Army Corps of Engineers, adding public health and safety as a consideration for how they manage Lake Okeechobee. These discharges affect the health and safety of every person out here. Congressman Brian Mast is moving forward in the fight to stop Lake Okeechobee water releases and curb the spread of toxic algae. He has introduced a bill that would make health and safety a priority for how the Army Corps of Engineers manages the lake. It's trying to make sure that we are given priority in law because right now we're not given any priority, any recognition whatsoever. And as a result, we're being taken advantage of. Congressman Mass says this new prioritization system would urge the Army Corps to keep lake levels low during the dry season. Currently, lake levels are kept higher during the dry season for irrigation and recreation. But he says that forces lake water to be released during the rainy season, bringing toxic algae to the Treasure Coast. This can come to an end. It's within the process that it comes to an end. Unfortunately, there's no priority given to it, so it's not coming to an end. Congressman Mass says this bill will be formally introduced later on tonight. He says he plans to speak with other legislators from Florida to try and garner up support. In Stewart, I'm Tori Simkovic, WPBF 25 News.